It is just past 4 p.m. here in Lahore. I'm Mukhar Rizvi coming to you live from the Indus News headquarters. These are the top stories. We begin in Afghanistan. Intense fighting between government forces and the Taliban has claimed 37 lives. At least 10 Taliban fighters and Afghan soldiers were killed during clashes in the eastern Paktia province. At least 16 people have been killed after two powerful earthquakes struck the Philippines. Officials said that dozens more were injured, while an unknown number of people are trapped under the rubble of collapsed buildings. At least five people have been killed in clashes between rival pro-government factions in southwestern Yemen. The charity Doctors Without Borders said that 91 others were wounded in fighting in the rebel-besieged city of Taiz. In India, Congress President Rahul Gandhi faces his first electoral test outside his home state of Uttar Pradesh today as Indians vote in the third phase of general elections. Polling is underway in 116 constituencies of 15 states and union territories in this phase of the month-long elections. And in the NBA, the Milwaukee Bucks have beaten the Detroit Pistons to qualify for the semifinals of the Eastern Conference playoffs. The Bucks completed a four-game sweep of the Pistons with a 127-104 victory.